Justin Bieber surprises fans in California just hours before his assault case returned to a Toronto court this morning. This is Entertainment City. No sign of Justin Bieber at a Toronto court today for a brief hearing about his assault case. Just the singer's lawyer had to be there. Bieber is accused of allegedly assaulting a TO limo driver late last year. The case has been put over until May 12th. Far away from the legal drama, Biebs danced up a storm in a surprise performance at the Coachella Music Festival in California. And just hours later, the Canuck dropped his new heartbreaker vid. You're friends with Justin Bieber. Yeah. Our Brad Smith caught up with Texas-born singer Austin Mahone, who says even though he's been working with JB in the studio, both guys have their own style. You know, he's very successful, but I want people to give me a chance to show them that I'm, you know, my own artist and I'm out there to, you know, make a name for myself. Mahone's debut album, The Secret, is out May 27th. All that I could say was... If that was me, I would have killed that man. The world of Fargo goes from an Academy Award winning film to the small screen on FXX beginning tomorrow night at 10. We got exclusive access to the Calgary set where our Jill Belland chatted with the cast. A pleasure to be joined here by Martin Freeman who plays uh, Lester Nygaard. He's about as buttoned up as you can get, Lester. And then by a twist of fate he meets a character played by Billy Bob Thornton who kind of um, opens a door in his head that says you can take some control of your life. And by the end of the first episode, we see the results of that, which aren't always um, healthy. If you don't stand up to the boss, the wife, you're just going to get washed away. So tell us a little bit about the role that you play. I'm an ex-cop, and I try to give advice to my daughter Molly, who's played by Allison Tolman. Cold enough for you, Chief? Thought I'd strip down on my shorts, work on my tan. Is Calgary a perfect match for Minnesota? Calgary, it's, it's, it's the ideal place to do this. I've never had that frozen nostril hair thing before. They say, oh, your nostril hair's frozen. Do they? And you go out and think, wow, they really do. She's a star. Suzanne Rogers opened her home today, featuring the designs of fashion star Zach Posen. You know what? It's creating buzz. It's exciting. It's always nice to have a trunk show in somebody's home. It makes it a little more personal. A portion of the proceeds from the exclusive trunk show will go to charity. But the big event is yet to come. A massive runway and gala at the Carlu on April 28th, featuring Zach Posen's designs. It just gets better and better every year, so the runway is going to be pretty spectacular. Um, Zach Posen is a dynamic, dynamic guy. The stylish Suzanne Rogers presents tradition, which has previously showcased Oscar de la Renta and Marquesa, is all for a good cause. Raising funds for Boost Child Abuse Prevention and Intervention and Holland Bloorview Kids Rehabilitation Hospital. And on tomorrow's Entertainment City, we've got part two of your exclusive behind-the-scenes look on the Fargo set. Entertainment City, brought to you by Fallsview Casino Resort in Niagara Falls, the place you want to be.